Bet you're glad it's Friday. Well, it's about to get even better with The Feud. Okay, thank you so much. I'm your man, Lucky McCoy. Guess what? We've got two families ready to play. This family are looking to take home the jackpot today. Here's who's standing in your way. It's the Cooper family. Here's how it works. You and your family will guess the answers on the board to our survey questions. Whichever team gets the highest score goes on to play fast money for the chance to win 20,000 big ones. Are you ready for action? Let's kick things off with our first round. Can I have a person from each team join me over here? We're looking for five answers here. I'm gonna ask you a question, and you need to buzz in first to answer. If you can find what's hiding behind the top slot, you get to choose if your family plays the round or gives it a pass. We got 100 people to answer the following question. Name a household pet you could leave by itself for a couple of days. Think you got something? It's worth a shot. Let's see what the survey says. Cat. That's the number one answer. Decision time, will you play or pass? Looks like you're going for a clean sweep. Keep it up. You got anything for us? Ah, uh, yes. Our survey said... Fish. That's a good one. What do you think? Good, okay. Will that be one of the missing answers? Hamster. It's not on the board, so you've earned your first strike of this round. Oops. I'm gonna need your guess. Are you sure about that? Is that one of the ones we've got left? Chihuahua. Oh, it's another strike. Don't. Name a household pet you could leave by itself for a couple of days. Nice. Could it be up there? Let's find out. Rabbit. Oh no, that's strike three. Now it's the other family's turn to take a crack at it. It only takes one right answer to steal those points. If your answer is on that board, you'll steal that money in the bank. That's your answer. Time to find out if it's up there. Dog. You know the score. You win, so the points go over here. Let's check out the missed answers. Show me number five. 
Snake. Number three. Bird. What are those scores doing? Only one round down. There's still everything to play for. Let's get things going with the face-off. Okay, I need someone from each family to join me up front. We've got five to find for this one. Get ready to buzz in. We took a survey, 100 people. Tell me something you might boil before you eat it. You're first on the buzzer. What you got? Oh, yeah. Yeah. Yes. Let's take a look. Eggs. Top answer. You want to yeah. play or do you want to pass and force them to play? Uh. It's a good start. Let's see if your family can sweep up the rest. It's your go. What do you think? Hmm. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, then. Did anyone in the survey say this? Pasta. Oh, yeah. Oh, good. Think you've got a good answer? Let's hear it. Yeah? Oh, yeah, yeah. Got it. Is that one of the ones we're still looking for? Rice. Oh. Nope, not up there. So here's your first strike. Tell me something you might boil before you eat it. Okay. Only a few answers left. Have you found one of them? Meat. Oh, that's nice. Two answers remain. Oh. Oh, yeah, yeah. Interesting answer. Is that answer up there? Vegetables. The board is almost clear. Yeah. What will you go for? I see where you're going with this. And is that the answer we need? Soup! You've got another strike on the board. Oh, you're so close. You just need one more answer. Understood. Let's see if that's a correct answer. Hot dogs. It's a clean sweep. The points go to this family. How are our families doing? Let's see. Two rounds gone, and it's just nip and tuck. Just like my last chin lift. Are you ready for a face-off? I need a contestant from each family, please. Yeah. 
The top five answers are on the board. Time to raise the stakes. We're doubling the points. We asked 100 people the following. Tell me what a bride might put on if she wanted to wear something blue. You're first. That's what you're going with? Survey said, shoes. It's there, but it's not top. Can you find the top answer? It's still up there. Tell me what a bride might put on if she wanted to wear something blue. Oh, OK. Show me that answer. Hat. No points. Are you going to play or are you going to pass? Oh, they're passing this time. Yes, this is a tricky one. All right, let's hear it. All right. Let's see if it's up there. Nail polish. You're on the board, but it's not the number one answer. All right. Yeah. Get your feuding face on. It's your go. Um, we have an answer. Show me the answer. Stockings. It's not there, which means you get a strike. Tell me what a bride might put on if she wanted to wear something blue. Okie dokie. Our survey says... Nightgown! Awesome! Oh, nice. Just two answers left to find. Answer accepted. There aren't many answers left. Is it there? Jewelry. Other family? I'd be getting ready if I were you. Look, we've got two strikes. We've got to be careful. Sure thing. Let's see if that's a good answer. Flowers. Three strikes. That's going to do it for you. Oh, oh nice. Our other family has a chance to steal. If this family finds just one answer, they'll steal the round. Here's your chance. You can do it. Good answer. All righty then. Is that answer good enough? Dress. That's not the one. And we got ourselves a winner. It's time to take a look at what we didn't find. The second most popular answer is... Underwear. What was stuck at the top? Garter. Shall we take a look at the scores? Friends, it's all to play for. Here comes the decider. Yes, 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 yes. Yes. No, no, no. Get ready to go full Nick Cage because it's time for the face off. I need two players down in front. I'm going to need five answers to this question. Now the points are worth triple, so this game is still up for grabs. We conducted a survey of 100 people for this question. Name something people use for security. 
Fast fingers, my friend. Feeling confident? Oh, yeah, yeah. Okay, sure. Let's see if you're right. Gun. That's not up there. Let's see if you can find the top answer. Name something people use for security. Here we go, then. Is it up there? Show me. CCTV. Nothing for that one. We still have the number one answer up there, just waiting to be found. Name something people use for security. Feeling lucky? Let's run with it. Locks. Looks like you finally struck gold. You're on the board. It's make up your mind time. Pass or play. Okay, you're gonna play. Let's see what happens. Hey there, looks like it's your turn. That's good. Time to check the board. Alarms. You got it. You look like someone who's got a good guess for us. Let's try it. Let's check the board. It's not up there, so this is your first strike. Whoops. Got a guess ready? Because I'm gonna need one. Okay. Said with confidence. Survey says, police. That's oh, another strike. Oh. Oh. Name something people use for security. Uh -huh. Is it up there? Let's hope so. Weapon. Ouch, third strike. Oh, it's time wow. for the other team to have a crack at this. All they've got to do is find one answer on the board and they can steal the round. You could steal these points and give yourselves a great chance. Yep. Let's see if it's there. Dog. You've cracked it. Congrats. This round is yours. What were our leftover answers? Show me answer number four. Home. I can't believe we couldn't find the top answer. What was it? Money. Before we move on, let's take a moment to see the current scores. It ain't over yet. We need one more round to settle things. <laughs> Neither team has surpassed 300 points, so that means we need a decider. Let's play Sudden Death.
Can I have someone from each family join me, please? This time, I just want you to give me the top answer. Ready those feuding fingers? All you need to do is buzz in first and give me the top answer to win this round. 100 people, we asked them the following. Name an occupation in which people have a chance to become famous. You got in first. That's what you think, huh? Is it on the board? Actor! It's on the board! You've won! Now, you're going to play Fast Money! Sorry, Cooper family, but you didn't make it a win today. What should we do now? Oh, I know. Let's play fast money. I need two people. You're the captain, so you get to choose who goes to play fast money with you. That's a fine choice. You're both going to do great. OK, now I'm going to ask you five questions. I want you to try and give me the most popular answer. Now, if your answers combined with your teammates add up to 200 points, you're going to win the jackpot. Your time starts now. Name something kids get yelled at for sticking their fingers in. Name something people say they have to catch up on. Name something specific that people pickle. Name something a bank robber needs to do his job. Name something in the house people turn on while doing chores. That's everything. It's time for your teammate to have a go. Going second is a little more difficult. You'll answer the same five questions, but you cannot duplicate any answers we've had. If you do, you'll have to give it another guess. Your time begins now. Name something kids get yelled at for sticking their fingers in. Name something people say they have to catch up on. Name something specific that people pickle. Name something a bank robber needs to do his job. Name something in the house people turn on while doing chores. That's all five. OK, you can relax now. We're done. Right, let's get back here on stage and see how you both did. For starters, we asked, name something kids get yelled at for sticking their fingers in. Your answers? You should feel confident with these answers. Yeah. Nice work. That's a top answer. Question two. Name something people say they have to catch up on. 
So here's what you said. How many points are these answers worth? Ooh, unlucky. Sleep. That was top. Next up, we asked, name something specific that people pickle. This is how you answered. Our survey says, okay, you really need to get something going on the last two questions. So the top answer, cucumbers. Next, we asked you, name something a bank robber needs to do his job. You said, how many people said those answers? That's a top answer, great job. And the final question, name something in the house people turn on while doing chores. What were your answers? And the final survey says... Oh, ah! close. But as they say, close only counts in hand grenades and horseshoes. No, Sorry, no, but you no. didn't get enough to win the grand prize. Dang, you didn't win the $20,000, but we can still give you some cash. We're going to add your fast money score to the points from the previous rounds and turn them into cash. That concludes the feud. We'll see you all again very soon. Goodbye.